Mm-hmm. We open this one. 
and you can see, like you see, you have already opened this one. So I will take you a little bit closer here, so you can see what's inside. Now, when you open the box, you can see, and you can see, guys, this one is this one is very big lathe. You cannot believe how big this is if you can see like I see here. So when you get this one, first one you get the toolbox, which is very heavy. And we're going to open this one after and you can see what's inside. After that, you get the center point with one which we're going to open after. After that, you get drill chock with this one tail stop. And I am not really sure what this is, but we're going to open and see. I think it's some oil or something, but we're going to see after that. And the most best thing you get with this one is that you get professional uh, change tools or what they call it, for thread, for cutting and everything. Very, very good that they have included this one. Here's the lathe, it's very much oil. This one they call Bernardo, but we're going to take up this one and see. I have already built some table for this one. I didn't film that one because maybe it's not so uh, interesting for you. But what we're going to do now, we're going to take up this one and I'm going to need help because this is over 120 kilos. We we'll clean this first and I will show you every feature and, and you will get every information about this lathe a little bit later. But now we take this up. Before uh, I show you the lathe, uh, I want to show you what you get when you buy this one. Uh, and after I will show the lathe, everything is clean from oil. But before that, I show you here everything. And you get this center point DM2312. I think it's very good quality. Second, you get this uh, very big chock, drill chock, so you can make hole. And with that, this one goes here and it's very big, very heavy, good quality. <clears throat> and you can see here B60. After, like I showed you before, you get 12 millimeter uh, professional cotton tool, which I appreciated that it's included. And after that, it's too much stuff. I take my hand because here is the chalk key, it's a little bit oil, but I will take off everything. Here is this one. And this one is to lose the chalk from the lathe. And you get three uh, jow, jow, I don't know what's called this in English, but you understand what this is. And you get the thread gears, which is very oiled. We have to clean this one. <coughs> you get one like this for oil. You get this one to tool I will show you later. Yeah. 17, 14, here. and we'll see what's inside here. Here is the cheap one center point detail stock. <coughs> uh, 
and we will see what's inside here. And you get another big uh, center point. I think this is for the chalk. Um, and here is some, I don't know what's called in English this one, for to full oil, handle, more screw like this and you get two extra flues and stuff like this i didn't know this what we're going to need this one but we will check everything we've got in this quality toolbox which i like very much one more thing i want to show you before i show the lathe this one I saw, I told you that was oil for the gear, I was wrong. Uh, this is not oil, so you don't do mistake. This is the paint for this lathe, two colors. If you damage this one somewhere, you get the extra paint here so you can make a good finish. So your uh, uh, lathe will be always like new. So you get this with you, that is a uh, paint not oil remember that i think we begin with the gear box here here you have all the gear for the threading and here you have two speed and this is safety so machine will not start if you not have the cover on which we will put soon but this one is two speed begin the brand this machine is called Bernardo Profi 505 WQV and this one is a Austria company but it made somewhere in China and I don't know and here you have a speed controller you can adjust the speed and here you have 52,000 and the B1000, 100 to 2000. Here we have some change automatic fitting, which direction this can go. And this one is the speed for the threading. In You can change the speed uh, for the automatic fitting. I'm not going to do this in detail because I cannot so good in English, but I will try my best. Here you have this cover which will automatically stop the lathe when you open this one. Here we have on off also, and this is MPC lock. And here you have forward and reverse. Honey is from Austria and like everybody know, everything makes in Germany and Austria, it's quality. So no joke. And this one is really bigger and you can imagine. The thing I like about this lathe, and there was uh, the reason I buy two of many things, but one of the things I want this lathe is you get this cover here and you get this automatic fitting in that way, which I will show you. Nice. And here is the key for the tool holder, which included and this is a normally what you what you get when you buy this one but i have ordered the quick change tool multi-fix uh, which is the best on the mark and uh, i will make video with that as soon as i get and because is that one is a little every lathe have a little trick to make uh, to install the um, uh, quick change tool so i will make a separate video for that one so you can see how it installed but it's a separate video it's coming soon so make sure you subscribe to my channel and don't miss that video and when you shake it up you put like this and this don't move anywhere here you have a tail stock it's some like this very good quality actually i like very much very much what we're going to do this now is we're going to start this one for the first time and i hope uh, everything will go well 
Now we're going to start this for the first time and I hope everything goes well. I know we have to do to put to the reverse or like this. All right, all right. Like this. Now it's starting. And one thing I forgot to say, it's 750 watt motor, a pretty strong motor, which we will test in the second. doesn't come up to 1000 here but 950 something like you see so now I'm going to change to the speed one and we will see if we can get 2000 rpm now I have changed to the speed 2 and we will see if we can get 2000 rpm test this with some aluminium and metal I want first to first to show you all these features now in this way This one is awesome. One of the reasons I buy this one is this, this, and this one. It's worth money.
very good like it we will try now in steel This tool is not so good, so I, will, I didn't use this one it come with. So really big for my workshop, bigger than you can imagine, and uh, powerful, have all the feature you need. Uh, yeah, should you buy one of this? Definitely. And I got this one in a very, very good price. If you have a not so big workshop like me, you should definitely buy this one if you have bigger workshop why not bigger lathe but this one is big enough for me and i'm going to use this in my workshop for my thank you guys for watching don't forget to subscribe make sure you don't miss that uh, another video we're going to make with the multifix uh, how to install and if you have time you can check out my another videos which is over 200 uh, or videos on my youtube channel with different ideas and different life hacks and tools we make here for fun thank you very much have a nice day take care of you bye